Oh, hi there. I'd just like to... And Lance would also like to... Pay our last respects... To Stephen Reed. No, I'm only kidding, he's only broken his arm. Cut to Stephen. Hello! Hello, everybody. Welcome to June 2024 update. So, what we got new for you this month? Well, obviously, the uh, high topic at the moment is Fajr. Stephen Reed uh, had a little accident, shall we say, and he uh, fell over and landed on his arm and he's uh, broken a part of his arm so basically when it comes to our A project at the moment final report and object legacy reshoots uh, he's become a bit limited for what he can do so now we're switching stuff around and we will probably start going on to block C and ironically it's it's called block c as well because that will be the the block that we bring in all the characters that we want to come back for cameos so you might start seeing some familiar faces in a trailer speaking of a trailer i know i've been teasing you with a final report trailer for months and months and months and months and months and months and months, and months. well I used to be a businessman. The businessman, you could say. Hard life had other things in mind. Moving gears. Oh, and my voice went as well. <clears throat> to our little, new little IP, Memory Remains, by the wonderful Stephen White and Dave Brewer. Uh, we have had our second read through. And as of yesterday, we have started location scouting. I might even show you a bit of footage as I'm talking. Me see me and Steve in the car going around. See me, us and Dave doing a bit of read through on scripts. It's coming on quite nicely and as I've said before, it's great to be working on a film that's... I know it sounds silly, but that's not my own. Like I'm helping someone see their vision come to life and I, I really like that idea moving forward so I think once we've gone to this final report with final being in the title for a reason um, it will be nice to shift gears and kind of be in that sort of semi producer role where I'm helping people make films rather than maybe making films themselves that's not to say I'm going to stop at all I mean there's a possibility I might, I might get burnt out. It happened before, I disappeared for four years, and yes, you can tell me off as much as you want to, because I do it to myself all the time. I'm a very naughty Nicholas. So, that is updates on Final Report and Memory Remains so far. We may have a few casting announcements soon. Uh, for Final Report, We'll be adding a couple of brand new characters, and these are members of the Warriors Order. So we'll be delving deeper into this supernatural world, so I'm happy to see that. As for Memory Remains, Steve has his eye on a certain cast member from Object Legacy. Obviously, I haven't approached the individual at the moment because we're still getting the finite script we want it completely locked no more edits so i can then send it to this certain person for the role but aside from that it's looking promising you may see a couple of behind the scenes teasers as i mentioned my uh, i'm starting to do a video diary for memory remains as we're working through it as we're location scouting as we're doing read throughs and it's quite an exciting process and Shifting gears back to final report, it's like a, a cathartic thing for me. It's like my goodbye to these characters. 
Uh, and so, but part of me doesn't want to say goodbye. It, I really doesn't because I love these characters so much and some of them have been in my head much longer than before the object came out because it was a different world then that connected and became one big and I hate to say this word, cinematic universe. So that is the way it cr the cookie crumbles and thankfully there is a point after where we have a 10 year gap in the storyline and that could be our perfect time for recasting if I was ever to get in a position where these this little universe I've created is produced in the big screen shall we say um, and then you can legitimately go with new actors playing older versions of these characters and to me I feel like that justifies that not that I, I want to get rid of everyone but there's there's people that can't come back there's people that have got commitments they've moved away so it's an unfortunate situation when you have a develop a project that has been in development for so long especially when you're making so many films at once they're all connected you've got to have all the same actors at the same time so it is just one of those logistical things but a final report for me will be the swan song don't get me wrong object legacy is going to be the big epic conclusion and you've seen snippets of it in the shape of things to come but for me final report is us treading the waters into the next chapter of this universe and giving you a glimpse of well to steal the title of one of our previous films the shape of things to come so Thank you ladies and gentlemen and others who may be joining us on this little update. So, final report, slight setback by Stephen Reed. Take it away Steve. Hello, Stephen Reed here. Nice to see you all. Uh, just to let you know that I'm still very enthusiastic about filming and we're going to be working around my arm as best I can but obviously I'm very limited with what I can do but I haven't lost the enthusiasm I'm sorry I've delayed everything but unfortunately I took a tumble and broke my arm and it's very very painful <laughs> so we'll see you real soon bye bye for now Thank you, Steve. So, yes, we're going to try and work around his injury as much as possible. Obviously, don't, we don't want to make him uncomfortable. But we are going to try and still do some filming because there's a, quite a few scenes that he can do where he's sitting down and his arm isn't in shot. So we should be able to get around that. Memory remains is, is, is progressing quite fast, actually. We're actually looking to start possibly filming by the end of the year. Don't... Don't, don't hold me to dates, don't hold me to dates. But, you know, it may happen, you never know. So, is there anything else on the horizon? Well, it may have just come out for you, but we've got a new little movie called, well, it's not like, not really a movie, it's more of a, a read through of the original short story of The Object and that was not the only short film that we made that was based on a short sort of story. Sorry, I slurred my word there, but I'm not cutting it because I like to be honest. Yes, so obviously the second film in the anthology universe, The Fear Inside, was also based on a short story. So will we do a story time narration for that? I think we might. But I don't think I'll be narrating it this time. I think that honor should be reserved for the star of the film. So I'll keep you up to date with that. We've still got some more inside projects. We've still got the big one, obviously looking inside the businessman, which are um, a possible audio slash visual commentary to it. To it. Uh, a couple of behind the scenes bits um, we're still logistically thinking about what we can do with Doctor Who we're thinking about a wrap up film um, and comedy movie is 
currently shelved, but we're looking to bring it back once the dust has settled on other major things. So that is pretty much this update for this month. Thank you very much for being patient. I hope you're enjoying all our new content. I hope you're really looking forward to our new films. Obviously the big one, The Object Legacy. I know people have been waiting for it for like 10 years, maybe even longer but it will be good. We've added so much stuff to it. There's loads of action, there's loads of drama, there's loads of heart to it. And I love the object legacy as like a goodbye to these characters. But then again, we've got Final Report, which is not only a goodbye to the characters, but it's a goodbye to the area that, we're, that the characters are in. It's a, it's a, um, a chapter it's a it's a film about moving on essentially uh, and I think it works really well and obviously then we've got memory remains which I'm so happy to be just involved with and so so is Lance Lance is very happy about being involved as well aren't you Lance Lance you gonna come up here no come on come on don't be shy yeah, that's him. oh we, yeah he's being shy I'll go on then if you have to Anyway, I think, oh, excuse me, I think I farted. Um, I think that's all for me today, and I shall see you soon, possibly behind the camera, possibly in front of the camera. Who knows? Who dares to dream? But I'll be around, unfortunately. I'm only kidding, right? See you soon, people. And... Yeah.